the indigenous people of Biafra seek uh, for the United Nations, uh, European Union, and others uh, up over Namdekano's uh, detention. Wow, this is getting more interesting. Yes, definitely uh, for those that did not, you know, get the headline correctly, I'll see. The indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, uh, six United Nations, UN, uh, and European Union, EU, and also others uh, of international community organization uh, in Nigeria, uh, IPOB, uh, as, you know, seek for help over Namdekano's uh, detention. Uh, according to the uh, government of Nigeria, the proscribed uh, indigenous people of uh, Biafra, IPOB has urged uh, the United Nations, European Union, and United uh, States to intervene on the continuous uh, detention of its leader, uh, Mazi Namdi Kanu, uh, by the federal government uh, of uh, Nigeria, saying uh, the action of the Nigerian government uh, was against a nationally, a nationality or nationally acceptable uh, standard aside from the United Nations, uh, uh, European Union, and also United States. Uh, the group also urged uh, Israel, uh, the African Union, Amnesty uh, International, Human Rights uh, Watch, and all lovers of freedom across the globe to intervene before it is too late. Uh, that is what it is. Uh, I pop a uh, spokesperson, Indigenous School of Biafra, uh, spokesman, uh, Ima Parafu, while alleging that uh, the federal government of Nigeria continues to violate the fundamental rights of uh, Kano and also violating uh, the fundamental right of uh, Nigerian citizens, uh, yeah, definitely not only Kano, uh, which are IPOP spokesman, uh, Ima Parafu, while uh, alleging that the federal government of Nigeria uh, continues to violate the fundamental uh, right of Kano, uh, described the Mbatu leader as a prisoner of conscience. Uh, through a statement on Friday, I would say Ima Parafu argued that since his first arrest in 2015, uh, Kano has been subjected to what he described as an uh, egregious uh, violation of uh, his fundamental rights. According to him, uh, we must use this opportunity to put a uh, world on notice of ongoing extrajudicial uh, detentions uh, and persecution and also extrajudicial killing. Uh, it may not only be Kanu, uh, it may be someone else uh, as it is, uh, according to uh, Ima Parafu. Uh, we use this more opportunity and medium to put the world on notice of ongoing extrajudicial uh, detentions, persecution, and also widespread uh, uh, human uh, rights uh, violations in Nigeria. Uh, following the extraordinary rendition of uh, Mazi Nambe Kanu from Kenya to Nigeria, uh, without proper documentation for doing so. And uh, the longer incarceration and detention of Mazi and um, the Kano in the SS custody. Uh, we, the global movement, and family of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, uh, wish to state categorically that uh, to the people of the world that Mazi and the Kano is now declared a prisoner of conscience uh, since the have deemed fit uh, to arrest or rather I uh, have kidnapped the Namdekanu and there is no case you know and uh, no case uh, against the Namdekanu uh, rather I would say uh, the court uh, have no authority uh, to detain or to jail an innocent man and that is why they are trying to parabolate but as it is uh, the only uh, a person or the only thing that could make uh, them uh, the boy himself and his kinsmen release it in Namdekan, I would say, if there is a proper dialogue, uh, that is what it is, uh, because uh, Namdekan, as it is now, is a prisoner of conscience. It is a matter of uh, public uh, uh, record uh, that hundreds of uh, concerned citizens exercising their rights to peaceful protest uh, protested the incarceration of Mazi Namdekan, uh, but were massacred. Oh, oh my God, were massacred. I can uh, could remember one uh, in the, uh, 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 in the Lekki Togate uh, previously, uh, in the year 2020. It is a matter of public uh, record that hundreds of concerned citizens exercising their rights of peaceful protest protested the incarceration of Mazin Namdekanu, but were massacred in cold blood by Nigerian security services. Mm. As it is, uh, many more were arrested uh, without trial. Mm. Some uh, disappeared and have never been found till today. Uh, that is what it is. Uh, during the military uh, invasion of uh, his residence, also, as it is, uh, they would say, uh, 
uh, maybe because their military immunity covers them. Uh, yes, uh, during the military, uh, uh, it has been said that uh, uh, invasion of uh, residents, uh, code name Operation Python Dance, Mazi Kanu was uh, almost killed, uh, killed, save for his uh, miracles, uh, miraculous escape. Uh, this statement read in part. Well, also continuing, uh, the indigenous people of Biafra High Pope uh, spokesperson said, in peacefully articulating uh, the grievances of injured and oppressed people and in seeking the self determination for all such peoples, Namdekanu uh, broke no law within or outside or context of uh, the law and outside Nigeria. The indigenous people of Biafra High Pope uh, has been and remains a peaceful organization. Devoid, devoid of any violation. Uh, that is what it is. And meanwhile, uh, Sunday, Igbo and Inalanu had not even as close as uh, the you know so called uh, majority you talk about. Uh, but notwithstanding, uh, they have you know acted the way uh, they uh, deem it fit or deem fit uh, because as it is, uh, the truth must be told. It does not really matter how you uh, place the truth. It does not really matter how you come about the truth. Uh, but definitely, if you keep lying, uh, like lying Mohammed, definitely blasphemy will be your name. Then the truth will be heavier than you. Uh, just because uh, telling lies is more or less like a debt. Because the day uh, you're going to tell the truth, uh, you must have own or older person in 100 bucks, in 100 fools. Well, also continue the IPOB uh, uh, spokesperson said in peacefully articulating the grievances of injured and oppressed people and in seeking self determination for all such peoples, Namdekano broke no law uh, within or outside Nigeria. Uh, the indigenous people of Biafra IPOB has been and remains a peaceful organization, devoid of any aid or violence, and totally committed to its aim and objectives uh, through peaceful democratic uh, means as recognized by international law and definitely having regards therefore to all of the above and is continued extrajudicial uh, detention. We hereby declare Mazin Namdekanu a prisoner of conscience and uh, we do so because like Nelson Mandela, he broke no law nor committed any offense. He only advocated freedom for his people. Uh, from decades long apartheid level oppression and tyranny. Hmm, that is what, uh, because this so called uh, contraption uh, called Nigeria, I don't want to even buttress uh, much about Nelson Mandela. Uh, it has been said that uh, Kanu uh, is a more of uh, Nelson Mandela fighting for freedom of uh, uh, South Africa or thereabout. Uh, okay, we use this opportunity to put the world on notice of ongoing extrajudicial detentions persecution and widespread human rights violators and violation in Nigeria. In the same vein, we call on the United States, the great state of Israel, the European Union, the African Union, the United Nations, Amnesty International, Human Rights Watch, and all lovers of freedom to intervene before it is too late. Now you've uh, yourself, mm, yes, uh, those are the bodies that are going to join, uh, and also you are going to cry to uh, those are the bodies you're going to say, Plan B. How do we go about it? Yes, in the same vein, we call on the United States, one, the great state of Israel, two, the European Union, three, the African Union, four, the United Nations, five, uh, Amnesty International, six, and uh, Human Rights uh, Watch, uh, seven, and all over, uh, and all over of freedom to intervene. Uh, before it is too late, but it is uh, yes, yes, yes.